Rated M for Mature. your room. This is where you'll study and sleep for the next three years. Your training starts tomorrow at 5 a.m. Don't be late. Keep up! Take cover. Aim, shoot. Advance the next cover. Got it? Excellent, Jody. Okay, recruit. Now get rid of those oil drums. going.
Sunday stroll! Not bad.
Not bad, Jody. But if this wasn't an exercise, you'd be dead by now. If this wasn't an exercise, you wouldn't even be able to open your big mouth, Ryan. Congratulations, Operative Holmes. You made it. Welcome to the agency. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Jody. Welcome to the agency. Looks like you Great made job, it, Jody. Congratulations. Really good. What do I do if something goes wrong? There won't be anything you can do. That's what I suspected. Just checking. Who are these people? Uh, diplomats, politicians, businessmen, spies. It's the usual embassy crowd. But most important thing, act natural. If anyone speaks to you, you just smile. So do you want me to act natural, or do you want me to smile? I didn't know you had a sense of humor. Only when I'm scared to death. Ryan, I'm delighted you could attend. Always a pleasure, Sheik Ahmed. I uh, would like you to meet my assistant, Elizabeth. I was unaware that American diplomacy was undertaken with such disarming charm. The pleasure is mine, Elizabeth. Gentlemen, I give you back your host. We'll talk later on that. Until then, Ryan. He hates me. All the time he was imagining my head on a stick. He found you charming. I should be flattered. Okay, I'm gonna shake some hands, blend in, find some more quiet. You know what you have to do. Ah, uh, Ambassador, you're a sight for sore eyes. I need to find a quiet place. No, not now. It will attract attention. Elizabeth, I see you've escaped from our mutual friends. <laughs> A drink, perhaps? We should get to know each other better. Maybe later. As you wish. Later it is. Hayden, Hayden, are you ready? 
There's a large painting in one of the rooms upstairs. Behind it is a safe. The documents we're looking for are inside. But there are guards and cameras, so you have to be careful, you got it? It hurts like hell when you're too far away. Time to mess around. Look for an office on the first floor with a portrait of the Sheik. And watch out for the guards and the video surveillance. Did you see that girl fighting your vision? Crazy. If anyone notices, we're dead. Be careful, Aiden. You know you can't touch other people when you're controlling someone. An office with a portrait of the sheep. This is the place. There's got to be a switch somewhere to move the painting. Find it, Aiden. هل من أحد هناك؟ الرجاء الخروج من هناك على الفور ولكن ماذا تفعل هنا؟ إن هم رهد السيدات انصرف من هنا أيها المنحرف سأنصرف
sorry. I can't do anything to help you. Good luck. It's Ryan. Ryan! I was just wondering if you got my email. What, what, wait, what, what email? The one I sent three days ago. You know, I've, I've actually been having problems with my computer. What, what was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. <laughs> anyway, it, it's too late now, so maybe another time? Shit. Shit, I'm so sorry. I... You know, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Uh, sure, but I... How about around eight? Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. Now I get why you blasted my computer. You didn't want me to see Ryan. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again! I'm not yours, Aiden! I can have a relationship with whoever I want. This is my life. Oh, do you fucking hear me? This is my life! You know what? I happen to think Ryan is great. Right? He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm falling for him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm aware of what happened at the bar. Fuck you for reminding me! Ryan is not like that. Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look good. I knew I'd have to learn to cook someday, but I didn't expect it to be so soon. I gotta find something I can make in one hour with what's ever left in the fridge. Asian beef, oh. I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. Curried chicken with oven-baked vegetables. It'll take some time in the oven, but it seems doable. Pizza delivery. 
I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no mess. I mean, it could be an option. Yeah, chicken curry, with a little down-home flavor. I mean, he's gonna love that. I mean, as long as I don't fuck it up. Thanks, Aiden. So far, so good. Well, into the oven we go. <gasps> you know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not gonna stop me from seeing Ryan. Books. Okay, on the bookshelf. Okay, great. Oh, crap. Crap, he's early. I'm coming!
the trash can in the kitchen. Dirty clothes in the basket in the bathroom. What should I wear? Oh, hi, Ryan. I've been waiting for you. <sighs> I don't know. Oh, hello, Ryan. Oh, do you like it? Classic, elegant, je ne sais quoi. I don't want to give him the wrong idea. Oh. Oh, hey, Ryan. Yeah, whatever, I just, like, threw these old things on, cause... Yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool. Is it not enough effort? Hot. He is gonna see a whole new side of me. You might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. Period. Come on, Aiden, don't be a pain in the ass.
Chill out, Jody. Okay, just calm down. There's no need to panic. You're gonna be great. Christ, Aiden. Look, you just don't get it. Yeah, that's very funny, Aiden. Wow, it's very romantic. <laughs> I didn't behave yourself. Hey, this is important to me, and I'm counting on you. Hi. <laughs> uh, Chateau Margot, 2001. The guy in the store said it was a pretty good year. That sounds good to me, so. Why don't you sit? Um, I'll get the, um, the thing that opens the wine. <laughs> cool apartment. Huh? Yeah, thanks. I didn't. For fuck's sakes. Do you want me to open it? No, oh, no, I'll do it. <laughs> to your new apartment. To my new apartment. <laughs> wow, so when did you move in? Um, a couple weeks ago, yeah, 
the agency found it for me and all furnished and everything, which is actually the first place I've ever had just by myself. So it's weird getting used to the idea of it. <laughs> and how about you? Where, where do you live? Oh, I uh, have a place just outside of town. Yeah, it's small, but you know, it's got a little garden and it's pretty quiet. And did you, did you grow up here? Or? No, no, I, I was born in Oregon. Now my parents and brothers still live there. But I, I moved out when I was 16. 16? Oh. Did you get, get kicked out or something? Uh, well, things were pretty chaotic at home. My, my stepfather liked to beat me when he had too much to drink, and, uh, I just decided to get out before one of us went too far. Um, how did you end up joining the CIA? I, uh, I went through college. I'm gonna go check on the dinner because this cooking thing, it's a whole new adventure <laughs> for me. You need help? No, but why don't you go sit and more wine would be nice. <laughs> okay. Mmm, smells good. Oh, it's um, chicken curry with oven baked vegetables. I mean, that's what it's supposed to be, so. I didn't know you cooked, I mean, it looks great. I'm, I'm glad, I'm glad you like it. So we've been working together now for what, what, two years? I know almost nothing about you. Well, I mean, there's nothing much to say. I grew up with my parents on the DPA campus, and then, and then Nathan looked after me, and, well, I mean, you pretty much know the rest, so. You know, your parents, do you, uh, you still see them? No. No, I don't, I'm, I think they were just terrified about how different I was. So, Nathan and Cole, they, they brought me up more or less. They taught me how to cope with Iden, how to accept myself as I am. I mean, it wasn't always easy, but you know, I'm, making progress. You know, did, did Nathan ever manage to explain to you why you have this link with Aiden? No. I mean, not really. I mean, they learned a lot of stuff about the infra world. Really not much about Aiden. I mean, I, I don't think even he knows who or what he is. <laughs> it's like, is he here now? listening to us and... Yeah. Yeah, he never leaves me. Uh, what about you? Do you have do you have any family here? No. No, my uh, my parents are still in Oregon. Go to see them as little as possible. <laughs> and are you um are you married or anything? No. No. But, yes, I mean, I, I, I was. You know, my ex-wife and I have been separated for uh, two years. And, uh, yeah, it couldn't work. I mean, it, in the end, it didn't. You know, we had our good times, but uh, eventually we decided to go our separate ways. How about you? Anyone on your radar? I've got Aiden, so. I mean, anyone in our world. You know, Aiden kind of has always made people run away. 
or, or maybe it's me. Maybe I'm just too odd for anyone to be interested in. You're special, Jody. I has got nothing to do with this. Stop. Jody, what's the matter? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's not, um, it's not your fault. There's, there's just, there's some things that I can't forget. It's okay. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry. I better go.